Hi, I'm Tim Gibson and I'm going to talk to you about diagnosing some common washing machine problems. Now, uh, if you're running into uh, some situations uh, with your washing machine, one of the most common things is whether it's not draining properly. In the back of the washing machine, you will have a, uh, the supply lines and your drain lines back here. So, if it uh, is not draining properly, now this particular line here, I can't pull it out and show you, uh, but if you have some residual water in your tub, it's mostly caused by maybe the drain is clogged. Uh, now this one's tied together so we can't pull it apart to show you, uh, but what you want to do is there is a seal on top of this. It's a good idea to pour uh, Clorox or to put a vinegar uh, baking soda mixture down this line uh, to keep that line clear. You can also remove this hose from the back of the washer and to make sure it is not obstructed. Uh, there can be debris and certain things that pass through your washing machine that can clog up this line after a while. Now, if you're just not getting water, you might want to check your valves here and just make sure that your valves are open. And a good tip here, if you ever go anywhere for a long period of time, it's a good idea to cut those valves off to make sure you don't have a busted line while you're gone. Uh, the other things that can go wrong is just making sure that uh, you want to make sure all your knobs are in the correct position and uh, that they are not uh, perhaps uh, halfway between a, a place. So if it is, uh, you may flip this, if it's not washing or doing anything, it may be that your knobs are not all the way in the, in the right place. So you want to make sure, and most of these have detents so that when they are on the right cycle, you will actually hear an audible click when that's in the right place. Now, the other problem that's a common problem that when your washing machine is not working is that the door may not be closed. This particular model actually has a door lock light since it's a front, since it's a front loading and it will actually give you an audible tone and a light if the door is not closed properly. I'm Tim Gibson and that's how to diagnose some common problems with your washing machine.